It really occurs to me that uh, the internet, more specifically social media like Facebook and Twitter and LinkedIn for business people, et cetera, et cetera, it really is the new town square. Social media. What kind of numbers are we really talking about? And as marketers, what does that mean for us? Today on the Marketing Minute, I'm joined once again by Tim Davison as we examine the phenomenon and numbers of social media. It's kind of the place where people go to chat over the virtual backyard fence to get late-breaking news and information. Like we were talking a few minutes ago, the Browns drafted a, uh, a quarterback. Johnny Football is his name. I found out about that on Twitter. I found out about uh, the polar vortex from a Cleveland meteorologist, Betsy Kling's Facebook page. Ten years ago, 20 years ago, certainly more, you waited until they told you on the radio or waited till the newspaper came out or maybe flipped on the TV. But now it's instant and it's everywhere. So, Tim, specifically, how many people are we talking on social media today? Well, uh, the stats I've seen, and it was taken by three different organizations, including Macworld and Social Nomics and um, Browser Media, show that of the people who go to social media sites, and there are tens of millions in the United States, 56 percent are still on Facebook, the big dog. The business site LinkedIn is reportedly number two at 14%, uh, Twitter 11%, and Google plus nine. I've heard Twitter is really growing, but these were stats taken as of fourth quarter of 2013. And this is interesting to me. People spend over 15 hours per month on Facebook. 15 hours per month. This is kind of a sidebar, not really a social media site, but YouTube, who's owned by Google, the search engine. The video audio site reports 92 billion monthly worldwide views. That's incredible. So now that we've got the numbers, what do we do with them? Coming up in the next episode of the Marketing Minute, we'll examine how to turn those numbers into a marketing strategy for your business.